Fight! Welcome back to Heal and a Seal, and this is the exciting main event. Well, the, the final, final main event of Heal and a Seal. That's right, we got King David, who's already off to a pretty good start, trying to win the title away from John Harrington in this steel cage. That's right, and this match is unofficially sponsored by Corona. Change your latitude. One of these men will be changing latitudes as they climb up that unforgiving cage. That's right. So we've got we've got uh, John right now trying to. He's putting David up on the turnbuckle already. Oh, and a headbutt from David, and David's gonna. Oh, he just comes right back down. I guess he doesn't want to do any of that flying stuff. And this match is for the title. If you remember, uh, David had the title and then lost it at Summer Sham to uh, John Harrington. In a epic battle, and so this is David's rematch, as he is, uh, you know, uh, given for being the former champion. You at least get one rematch. And so uh, John's pulling David into the ring and dropping a leg right on the back of his head. This is this has been quite a show. DDT from David. That last tag match was amazing. I don't mind telling you. Um, oh man. John's got him in that hold. David's ch uh, giving him a hold of his own. They're just back and forth. These two guys, you know, they put a lot of work into Game That Tune. And uh, they also put a lot of time into, you know, making their bodies into weapons for our entertainment as they bash each other back and forth. Punch, kick, punch, kick. And they both end up falling down. And David's the first to get up and drags John's body. But John's quick to get up. Oh, and he kicks David in the stomach. I mean, he's got he's got to prove why he's the champion. And we got Sonic doing the play the referee right there. You know, got to count fast. But hopefully he won't be fast count. Oh, and a nice little uh, a senton. Yeah. Oh, but David picks him up and drops him on his back for a nice little you know suplex type thing. He's got him in a chokehold of some sort, a chin lock or some kind of rest hold. I don't know why these guys need a rest. Oh, the DDT from John. Pulling David into the middle of the ring. Gets him in that uh, figure four. Now, I don't know. The, David was trying to get to the ropes to get some leverage, but he ended up getting out of it anyways. There is no rope break in cage matches. In order to win this match, you have got to climb to the top and get down on the other side. Upon your two feet touching the ground, you will be crowned victorious. And none of the, neither of these men have tried to climb the cage yet. Although David's going up top with an elbow drop to John's back. That's going to hurt the vertebrae. I don't mind telling you. Oh, but John gets up and delivers a sick DDT right into the ring and puts him in a chokehold right then. And David just he gets out of it. He's uh, he doesn't want to, you know, get knocked out by one of those moves. Another DDT just crushing David's skull and his vertebrae into the the mat. Oh, and a, a nice little backbreaker by John. John is really commanding the match right now. Oh, but David with a super kick out of nowhere goes to the top rope. Is he gonna climb or is? Oh no, he wants the crossbody. He wants to inflict as much damage onto John as he can. Oh, but he's given a DDT for his troubles. And John saying he can go up top too with a, a nice little set on. Well, right into David's chest. That's going to knock the wind out of him. Possibly break a rib. You know, there's all sorts of damage that can go on. Oh, and David with a running slam. Oh, but he's gassed. He's getting some air. John is dazed. David. Oh, no, John with a backwards kick thing oh man wow that's this match is heating up back and forth oh John with that backbreaker trying to you know dislodge the vertebrae I'm keeping saying ver oh a power bomb by David wow that'll get me to shut up oh John with the fight no oh, wow anything or some kind of move like I'm not Joey Styles a spinning kick to the face but David gets up. He is King David after all. He's flung to the ropes. Oh, but John tries to, but there's no pins. What are you doing, John? You're out of your mind. He must be dazed from all the, the, the punches and the 
kicks and the, the you know, David's going to try to do so. Oh, and a clothesline right in the middle of the ring. And is he going to go for another one? Yeah, but da John moves out of the way. John. Oh, wow. That move was nuts. What a maneuver. John with a running drop kick. Oh, but David gets up and chop right across the chest. That'll knock the breath out of you. Oh, and David goes for the power bomb. Oh, and another backbreaker by John. So, oh, uh, run into the. Oh, drop kick again! That's really got to be doing some damage to David. Oh, but. Maybe David. Oh, an arm break! Can he, uh, can he break David's arm? If he can break his arm, David won't be able to climb very well. That's a pretty good strategy, I guess. <laughs> oh, and a nice little body slam. John goes up top rope! Oh, he tries for a... He was gonna... He, he, he jumped on him. That was cool. Then he tried to go for a pin. I guess he's still a little dazed. And David's trying to get some magic going. John is really just... Oh, David with the running power slam! Picks him. Oh, John got a slam of his own. Oh, John is going up the cage. Will he make it to the other side? It's looking pretty good. David trying going after him. It's oh, and John is the winner and still the champion of Game That Tune Wrestling. What a match. What a cage match. These two men beat the hell out of each other. And finally, John defended his title. What a great... Uh, this has been a wonderful event. Heel and a seal. I hope you've all enjoyed it. There were some great matches. Maybe not that Donkey Kong match. I don't know why I keep giving it shit. I may, I just wasn't bananas about it, you know? Come on. <laughs> wow. Yeah, I did, did I do the whole match just to get to that one joke? I don't know. Find out next time. But until then, make sure you're still listening to Game That Tune. Listen to Game That Tune Radio because that's really awesome. I mean, both of those things are awesome. Keep checking out our uh, wrestling shows. Uh, they're a lot of fun. I enjoy doing them. And um, I'm planning out the the next uh event for december um i haven't got a name yet so if you want to shoot me some suggestions you know no tone and i might use one might not i don't know and i i just a little sneak uh peek right now i've been working on a women's division it has been uh you know we've done two shows without any women uh really involved um but i've started getting a bunch of uh female talent that I think will shock and amaze you and uh, at least make you giggle or say, well, that's a pretty cool match. Um, so keep an eye out for more GTW. And uh, congratulations again to John Harrington for retaining the championship. Um, I wonder who's next in line to try to, to, you know, unseat the king, as it were. Not King David, of course. But uh, maybe there's stuff that King David can do in the meantime. We'll, we'll find out. Uh, but just stay tuned for more Game That Tune Wrestling uh, in the future. And blast processing. <laughs>